the, she was crying. Who was crying? See, as far as she's on that, she's on that age. Well, she's not from that. 18 well, see, years. I'm telling you, John, please don't go but sing I in love. It's not bad. Why are you? Are you? All this ones we are saying now, please on Friday, on Saturday, come and join us for the traditional marriage. Are you serious? You're inviting us? So you're inviting me for the marriage, for the underage, for our marriage? You need to leave when to investigate. Me, I'm married for the age of 15 years. Mama, you married at the age of 15 years. You married at the age of 15 years. That was when the law does not exist. But in Delta State, now listen. In Delta State, no, she you people we're first her. You are in Delta State. Are you not in Delta State? Delta. You don't live here. <laughs> Even Anambra State too. Uh, Anambra uh, uncle law, child right law. Uh, you don't marry a girl below the age of. Hello everyone, welcome back to Obedia Talk Show. I greet you all with your time. Thank you so much for stopping by. So good to have you guys back. I really, really appreciate your support and love. Just in case you are new, please consider to subscribe. Turn on the bell icon as to be getting more updates from us. To all of you who have been following us, thank you and God bless you all. So guys, this video is very, very touching video. I just want to throw in something before I will play the video for you guys to see. This is a 14 years old girl. She's pregnant. Maybe probably the guy who is responsible deny, or maybe the girl don't even know who got her pregnant that did not say. But what we know about this video you're about to watch is that they are about to marry a 14 years old daughter to almost 50 years old man. Just imagine the age different. Imagine punishment. Mother is willing to give to her old daughter just because she got pregnant. They are not even thinking about the age different. They are not even thinking about this girl is still very young. What does she know about marriage? What can 14 years old do with a man who owed a know to be a grandfather? This very one now will be forced into this marriage. And he will be facing different abuse. But she cannot talk. And on that thing, the mom might even be using the pregnancy as if, uh, you know, she's uh, doing, he's doing the girl a favor by allowing, uh, accepting her in a pregnancy and all that. And in this interview, I don't know that woman that was with a baby, if she is a sister to this girl, and the other woman, old woman that is sitting at the other side, they did not even feel remorse. They are just talking with all pride as if what they are about to do is the best thing. How can you suggest your teenage daughter to this kind of life punishment? What kind of life and future do you think this girl is going to get with 50 something years old man? I'm just trying to use this video to tell our parents that if your teenager doctor gets pregnant, take care of that child. When she put to bed, she still has a very bright future ahead of her. That pregnancy is not going to stop her destiny. It's not going to stop her from shining. It's not going to stop her from going to school. But just that sometime, our mother are so ignorant and they don't even know the value of child. And they don't believe in their children. They believe that as you got pregnant, that your all is finished. So therefore, they can make any decision. Whether that decision will take that child to an early six feet, they don't care. This is very touching and it's very heartbreaking. Guys, I will allow you guys to watch this video. Leave your comment and share this video. I pray that that guy that interviewed them, they will be able to do something. And we want this video to go viral. We want that marriage to be stopped. We don't want them to condemn the future of this innocent girl. Please, I'm begging every one of you, share this video. 
Share it and God will bless you. Oh, it's, it's, that's, that's bad anyway. Uh, we know it's bad, but you should please go and tell her to hold uh, or it will remind her that we are to close her legs. But it's not for anybody's fault. We didn't force her to go and marry. You thought she was crying? Who's crying? See, as far well as she's on that, she's on that age. Not from okay. 18 Consider years. I'm telling you, John, please don't go go sing. I ain't lost. It's not bad. Why are you? Mm. I mean, all these ones we are saying now, please don't pray on Saturday. Come and join us for the traditional marriage. Are you serious? You're inviting us. So, like, Jana, so, can we investigate? Who knows? 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 Mama, you married at age of 15 years. You married at age of 15 years. That was when the law does not exist. But in Delta State, now listen. In Delta State, no, she, you people first her. You are in Delta State. Are you not in Delta State? You don't live here. Even Anambra State, too. Anambra, Uncle, law, child right law. You don't marry a girl below the age of 18 to anybody. And now you even marry her to somebody who you don't. So, as in because of because of her circumstances, somebody got her pregnant. At least we've known the boy. When you want to report to Lunu, Sina and Mosia, they are going to meet him. Oh, I'm not going to meet him. Mama, I'm from Mukandu. So, Kemo said, Marie, you can't have an action. If you can cross water, cross Anamu. Anamu, have you? Yes. So, you, you want me to come for the marriage? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Cross the Mili City by Niger. Yeah, yeah. They could be investigated. Yeah, you're not going to be on. Okay, I didn't make it. So you are inviting me for marriage for the girl that you people married out. Oh yeah, no, no problem. I will come for the marriage. So you married the girl. She's pregnant. You married her off. Are you are not inviting me for the marriage. Nobody married her off. So she married the man herself. Okay. Under age girl does not give consent. You don't, that's what I'm trying to make okay, you understand. Are, because if you are charged to court now, you are going to less than five years imprisonment for what you just did. I know what, I know what. Okay, so you are going to marry her now. Yes, you are going to marry her now. Okay, so you are going to so go say where you want to give her to now. Is it the person that got her pregnant? It's not the guy. The guy is dry now. And that man is about 50 years old. man. No, it's not up to 50. How many years? The boy is. For something. For something years. Uh, below 17 years. Below 17 years. The most important thing is that you and the person that reported to him should kindly go back to the village. Oh, Allah. Saturday, I'll come. My man got to come. Eh, don't worry, I'll come. I'll come. If I will come to the marriage on Saturday. I will come for the marriage, no problem. On Saturday. Where did they pass to Anam? I will call you now. 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 All right, so that's um, Kosi. She's fourteen year old girl. Um, she was ma she, she somebody got her pregnant, and they married her off to a forty something year old man in Asaba here. How in Asaba here? So I, I just went there now to talk to them. They're not telling me that uh, she has a right to marry at the age of fourteen or fifteen years. And in fact, they have even taken her. They are, the marriage is on Saturday. 
So I told them I'm going to call for the marriage. Not only that now, in less than 10 minutes, maybe we'll see whether them go there for this shop again. I'm telling them that they have a law called the child right and they don't want to listen to me. So we go go that water, go carry that cosy, come back today. Retrieve cosy. Alright, so it's crazy. I'm even talking to them and they're, they're even laughing. Say they, they collected bright price, you know, bright price from the girl and say nothing will happen, nothing will happen. So I can't we buy it. <laughs> so they don't know what's gonna happen now, alright? So let's see what happens in less than um, in less than 15 minutes. This is not about poverty. Those people are not, they are not poor. It's wickedness. It's wickedness. So it's not about poverty, being poor or being rich. So that is just wicked.